Thankfully, it's November, and Appalachian Wireless is offering the Samsung GS8 or the GS8 Plus for $100 off the regular price with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Following Sunday's shooting at a Texas church that killed 26 people, members of churches all across our region are undoubtedly wondering about the security measures in place where they go to worship. I visited three churches in Pikeville this week, and the pastors all say security at their churches is a priority. We have a team that the church installed called a risk assessment team. And that team is comprised of about five individuals who are church members, but are also um, have experience either in law enforcement or child protection or, or have a vested interest in it. We're blessed to have either retired or off-duty uh, law enforcement officers that are trained in certain protocols and we've invested time in, um, in getting some certain uh, processes in place. A uh, door is closed approximately around 11 o'clock and anybody that enters that door after that point has to be personally escorted by an usher. And while nearly every church has at least some security measures in place, there are churches like Liberty Free Will Baptists who are looking at even more options. Since this news that we've heard, we're actually putting in place this week increase in security measures. Security systems with cameras and monitors are pretty standard in most churches, and many put extra attention on the security of the younger attendees. No one is going to be volunteering with children or teenagers that haven't passed background checks and, and certain safety measures that's involved there. Yeah, the number one place where we focus on security is our children's area, our nursery, our, our children's wing. For the past several years, security measures at churches across the country have gotten stronger, and many in our region are relieved to know that churches in eastern Kentucky are no exception. You know, we want the congregation definitely not to have fear concerning this uh, subject. We want them to make sure they feel safe and at home they can bring their family. And we have public worship services open to anybody and everybody that wants to come. And with that comes a responsibility to make sure we are providing the best care and protection possible. Uh, make sure that the people that come here to gather and worship are protected and can worship God and, and come together as a community in safety. Most law enforcement agencies would welcome the opportunity to visit local churches to evaluate security protocols and make suggestions for additional measures if necessary. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.